there, there's no right or wrong in hiring a co-founder. Uh-huh. You know, find co-founders which have different expertise as you. Okay. You know? uh, so if you're an IT person, maybe try to find somebody who's uh, s- uh, more sales sales related. If somebody's right, marketing, right, maybe right. you get somebody who's so operational. Like someone yeah. who complements your yin and yang. Yeah, that somebody kind of who thing. complements your opposite attract. Uh-huh. You know? But doesn't mean that if you have two tech guys in the company, it's not going to work. Right. You know? All of this work or doesn't work right or wrong actually eventually boils down to only one key factor. And, and what is that? If I if I can take all my past relationship and I combine it together and I write a kesimpulan, okay, you know, a summary of uh-huh. what causes uh-huh. um, a relationship to listen to this. right or wrong. Uh-huh. Yeah, listen to this. It's very important. Uh-huh. It's only one word that you need to know. It's actually a word called maturity. Maturity. If you have enough maturity mm-hmm. within yourself, and of course your partner must also have it, you can make any relationship right. You can make any wrong right, and sometimes even the wrong, wrong would be right as well. Business, over time, over time, yes. Business might fail. You might fail it with your best friend. You might fail it with your cousins. You might fail it with people that yes. you truly respect yeah. or truly have a relationship with mm-hmm. on a personal level. But if you do not have maturity, whatever happens to the business, you will always have a bitter ending at the end of the day. But if you have the maturity, and the maturity is very simple, the ability to split your personal emotion with your business emotion when doing business with a co-founder. But it's kind of hard, right? Yeah, but in dating, uh-huh. it's the same. How you, are you <laughs> going to split your personal emotion with huh? your business emotion and not let both of it come together to cloud your decision? That yes. is maturity. Yes. So be it businesses fail or mm. be it businesses succeed. I, I've got my share of businesses succeed or fail. Uh-huh. Success, of course, is easier to keep a friendship. Uh, right, know? of course. But often or not, we have to face reality. Business, there, will, there will be failures. Yeah, there will be failures. You know, uh-huh. uh, Business might fail. You know? right. So if there's a business that fails or even it fails with somebody you're closely attached to, your best friends or your uh-huh. cousin, can you actually go out of it? Uh-huh. You know, Because if you, if you are unable to find co-founders and you don't know whether your co-founders are right or wrong for you, the most important aspect at the end of the day is whether the whole relationship ends well no matter what happens throughout that journey.